I always had an idea in the back of my mind I wanted to join the military. So I always admired you know, the men and women that wore the uniform and what they stood for. And after what, what unfolded on 9-11, it was like, you know, they need us now. The Battle of Fallujah was just kind of getting over with when we got into Iraq in the fall of uh, 2004. I was an armor, armor officer, and we were, we were over there with a mission, uh, both, I mean, both combat mission, but also hearts and minds. That was the, that was the big buzzword. I, I remember struggling to breathe because of the smoke and the dust, and, um, you know, realized that my legs were impacted, and I was not just gonna be able to, like, roll out of the vehicle. And I did limb salvage for about a year. I've had doctors tell me they probably should just remove your leg in, you know, in Balad or in Germany. But the age I was at that time, I, I was looking at myself going, what kind of father could I be? You know, what, uh, what, uh, what kind of life am I going to have with being in this much pain? I've had people say how hard it must have been for you to have your leg removed. And I say, it was easy. It was an easy decision, you know, once I worked, worked through the process. And, um, and it was a blessing. Sometimes I wonder why I didn't do it sooner. I think back to how extremely frustrated I was and anxious about the future back when I was in the hospital. And if you know, a soldier or another service member is going through something similar, I, I would just impart that there's hope. My role at Amazon, one of my responsibilities is advocacy for severely wounded, injured, ill, and caregivers. And you know, two things I wanted to do right away were get involved with the Warrior Games and then also get involved with the Invictus Games. When I was in the hospital, that would have given me a lot of hope and you know, something to really work towards in my recovery to be like, yeah, I'm gonna go to the Warrior Games. I have my trips, I have my falls. I certainly notice that there's something different about me every, you know, every step I make. Uh, but in the water, I don't. I feel that I can you know, swim just as well as you know, able-bodied people. It's uh, liberating. It's the one place, since I'm not an astronaut, that I don't feel like I'm missing my leg. When I hop in the water and push off from the wall, I feel like there's nothing holding me back. I just encourage you know, anyone who's struggling or maybe hit that, hit that point in their recovery where they don't know what to do next, really think about how you could get involved in adaptive sports and chart that path towards a healthy future. It's a, it's a great feeling.